Welcome back to the 1% Club. The Elliott Roger case stands as a grim reminder of the devastating consequences that can result from a dangerous combination of misogyny and untreated mental health issues. In May 2014, Elliott Roger, a 22-year-old college student, unleashed a wave of violence in Isla Vista, California, leaving six people dead and several others injured before taking his own life. The tragic events surrounding the case shed light on a complex web of societal factors and personal struggles that culminated in a horrific act that shocked the nation. This video aims to explore the Elliot Roger case, delving into the motivations, warning signs, and broader implications it holds for our society. Background and Early Life Elliot Roger was born on July 24, 1991, in London, England, and later moved to California with his family. From an early age, Roger faced challenges in social interactions and developed feelings of isolation and rejection. As he grew older, these difficulties exacerbated his underlying mental health issues, leading to a deep-seated resentment and anger towards women, whom he believed had rejected him. The Manifesto and Online Presence Prior to the attacks, Roger created a disturbing online presence, including a 137-page manifesto titled My Twisted World. In this document, he detailed his grievances and frustrations, blaming women for his loneliness and perceived inadequacies. He expressed a sense of entitlement and a desire for revenge against those he believed had wronged him. Roger also posted a series of videos on YouTube, revealing his misogynistic views and self-pitying mindset, further fueling his animosity towards women. Mental Health and Warning Signs Roger's actions were not solely rooted in misogyny, they were also influenced by severe mental health issues. Throughout his life, he struggled with various disorders, including high-functioning autism and a history of depression. Despite these red flags, Roger's mental health struggles were not adequately addressed or treated. This failure to recognize and intervene in his deteriorating condition played a significant role in the tragic events that unfolded. Community and Law Enforcement Response The Isla Vista community and law enforcement were caught off guard by the scale and ferocity of the attacks. The incident sparked discussions about the need for improved mental health services, early intervention, and the importance of addressing toxic masculinity and misogyny. The tragedy prompted soul-searching within communities, educational institutions, and law enforcement agencies, seeking ways to identify potential threats and prevent similar acts of violence. Broader Implications and Lessons Learned The Elliot Roger case serves as a stark reminder of the dangers of unchecked misogyny and untreated mental health issues. It highlights the importance of early intervention and support for individuals struggling with mental health challenges. Moreover, it calls attention to the pressing need for comprehensive sex education and promoting healthy relationships to combat toxic masculinity and prevent the growth of extremist ideologies. The Elliot Roger case remains a distressing chapter in recent history, emphasizing the urgency to address deep-rooted issues within our society. By fostering a culture of empathy, early intervention, and mental health support, we can hope to prevent future tragedies like the one inflicted by Roger. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel to be in the known of the latest stories of the 1% Club. See you next. Bye.